Hello and welcome back to Man V Film. It's time for another Blu-ray update video and this time I have the results of the Arrow sale. Um, there was one extra title that I placed after uh, I finished my live stream that I did which you can go back and watch um, if you're interested. And the reason I did that is for a friend. So I've got uh, nine titles here three for a friend, for a present, and uh, the rest for myself. So, as usual, you start to get these little booklets with the uh, arrow. doesn't really give you too much information that we don't already know, but it's nice to get them anyway. And I'm going to, oops, and I'm going to jump into um, what I picked up. So, first up is a movie that I've looked at several times on the sale, and that is Akiri XB1. From second run. Czechoslovakian movie. This science fiction movie looks like a kind of precursor almost to 2001. It looks very visually stylistic. It was one that I just watched in the trailer just had me super enamoured with what was going on and something that I said to myself I'm going to get that at some point. Uh, there was an unrelenting uh, drive that I was getting this one. This uh, this sale and I did. Uh, one that during the sale you guys kind of pushed me uh, in the direction of was Women on the Run. Um, this comes with a booklet as well which is rather surprising because I know it's been out for a while. Um, I know nothing about it, I just asked for noir recommendations, uh, you guys came to the forefront and said that, yes this, this was the one to pick up. I duly did so, and again, yeah, I did it, I, I bought it, and one um, very nice member gave me uh, some donation cash during the stream, as long as I picked up Merry Christmas, Mr Lawrence, and you know what, it was a movie that I wanted to pick up for a while, again, it came with a booklet, which I'm surprised about, I'm very happily surprised about that, I've not seen this movie in about 20 years, I remember loving it. It's got a great cast, a great story, and I am looking forward to revisiting this one. Um, I may not have picked it up, which, you know, would have let me down now. So a very thank you, a very big thank you to the person that offered me, offered me the money to pick this one up. I'm kind of glad I got it now. Uh, one of the first titles I picked up for my friend who loves Gaspar Noe, it's Climax, um, a movie that is not for everyone. I like it a lot. I think it is an attack on the senses. I think the dance sequence itself is just mesmeric. It is amazing. I love it. Um, the movie is just uh, pure id released. People unbridled by any kind of social context just going crazy. And I like it because of that. The filmmaking style is just ethereal almost and yeah I like it but it's not for everyone another one that I just got told to pick up just just cause because you guys are, are really great at enabling is Klaus Kinski and Double Face uh, this was in my basket the last sale it got took out um, and I'm kind of glad I've picked it up because well I do quite like Klaus Kinski I believe this is a giallo which is right up my street and, and I utterly love that um, another one for my friend uh, is The Exterminator, which is a great early 80s revenge movie. Although I kind of prefer Exterminator to. Um, yep, I was kind of the last minute addition after the sale. Just, he was like, can you pick that up? I was like, yeah, not a problem. Um, five pound titles. Five pound titles on Arrow sales are back. And it's a kind of bad thing. It's that easy entry into starting to build a basket to buy more titles. This one is Don Siegel's The Killers. It's Don Siegel. It was £5. Why the hell would I not buy that? This was the only £5 title I didn't have and I dutifully bought it. Next up we have the limited edition of Southland Tales. Now I've wanted that for a little while. Um, I did try and watch the movie once, way back uh, when it first came out, and I just I, I, I could never connect with the film. I know this comes with a much longer can cut, so I, I don't know if that's going to be better or not. 
if you've seen this movie and you've seen both cuts, which one would you recommend checking out? Because it's going to be pretty much like a first time watch because I've not seen this in the longest while. And next up, and the last one for this video, uh, the last of my pickups was for, again, my friend in Canada and that is King of New York on 4K. This is one of the best 4Ks I've seen. The image is amazing. It is a fantastic tale. Abel Ferreira just owns uh, this movie completely. It is wonderful. Christopher Walken gives a truly terrific performance. Uh, there's other performances throughout the movie that are equally as thrilling. And it's just one of these really captivating kind of gangster movies that just, wow, just wow. Wow inducing when I'm watching it. So there we go. All the titles that I've picked up from the Arrow sale, three for a friend, six for myself, and expect reviews soon on these titles. Thanks for watching, and of course, I'd love to know what did you pick up, if anything at all. Of course, there's more videos up here. You can join the Patreon, the membership program, or even just like, share this video it would be amazing. Thanks so much, and I'll see you next time.